Welcome back to the Wandering Wind Church. Today I'm reading day 17 of step one of the Life Recovery Devotional. Our title for today is Victim or Victor, which is wonderful, wonderful. And our Bible reading for today is 1 Samuel 17, 20 through 49. I will be leaving the Bible verses in the description of the video from now on so that, that way you can follow along and read on your own time when you can. Step one, we admitted that we were powerless over our dependencies and that our lives had become unmanageable. There will be times in life when right and wrong stand in stark contrast. Even when we know what's right and how things should be changed, the power may seem to be on the wrong side. We may feel powerless even though we know we are standing for what is right. But even when this is true, we still shouldn't give up. Sometimes situations where we feel powerless can prompt action that changes everything for the better. David observed as Goliath, the Philistine champion from Gath, came out from the Philistine ranks. Then David heard him shout his usual taunt to the army of Israel. As soon as the Israelite army saw him, they began to run away in fright. Have you seen the giant? the men asked. He comes out each day to defy Israel. David convinced the king to let him fight the giant his own way. He shouted to Goliath, You come to me with sword, spear, and javelin, but I come to you in the name of the Lord of Heaven's armies, the God of the armies of Israel, whom you have defied. Today the Lord will conquer you. The army saw themselves as helpless victims. Their powerlessness paralyzed them, so they just stood there and took the abuse. David took courageous action to recover their dignity. There are times when we need courage and God's help to fight against the tendency to remain a victim. We need to stand up for our human dignity and respond in new ways if we are to claim our recovery. With God by our side, there is no need to wait we can move forward in our recovery. This is powerful. This is powerful. When you have God on your side, recovery is always possible, and you can move forward in that recovery. You might not be able to do it in your own strength, but when you have God on your side, you can. When you have God on your side, you will, because God is the ultimate authority. God is the ultimate helper. God is the ultimate power beyond all addiction, beyond all forces of darkness in this world, and you might feel powerless now. But, but, you won't be powerless forever if you have God on your side, because you, yes, you have power beyond what you believe you have when you have God on your side. Yes, amen, amen. Remember, remember, people, the program of recovery is not a program that is navigated by leaps and bounds, but rather by steps and inches, by every day committing to recovering, every day committing to, to admitting that you're powerless over your addiction, believing that there is a power greater than yourself to be able to restore you to sanity, and making that decision every day, making that decision to turn our will and our lives over to the care of God. Those are the three steps that we take daily, even after we've gone through them the first time. The first three steps are steps that are daily practice, daily living. And so when we do that, when we have God on our side, we no longer have to worry about, are we going to be able to recover? We know we will recover. We know we will recover. So I want to encourage you in that, that you can recover, that you will recover, that one day you will find peace and you will know the meaning of the word serenity. Remember, remember, sometimes quickly, sometimes slowly, but always moving forward is the journey of recovery. And every day we ourselves find strength and hope in Jesus Christ. Thank you so much for watching, for listening.
for sharing, for subscribing, for supporting the channel in whatever way. Please pray for me in my recovery as I pray for you always in yours, that we might both be strengthened by each other's prayer. God bless you. I will see you again soon, God willing, and take care of yourselves. Remember to always seek recovery every day, every moment. Thank you, and have a wonderful day.